Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lanyel Kuzar and I'm the owner of Yes Event Decor and More. So yesterday I decorated for my nephew's fifth birthday party and he made sure that he called me. <laughs> He called me a couple of days before his birthday to remind me that I was doing the balloons for his birthday. He said, Auntie, my birthday's coming up and you're doing my balloons. <laughs> so we went up to his house and we did a birthday celebration. Um, I decorated, I did a balloon garland and a backdrop and then I also did a dessert and treat table. So I recorded the setup for you guys so you could see how everything came out, all right? So let's get into the setup and then make sure you stay tuned to the end so I can tell you some lessons learned, all right? Oh, and before we get into the setup, I just wanna let you guys know. So my sister paid this time, I did charge her. I charged her something <laughs> for the decoration. So she was sitting there watching me and critiquing me as I was creating my decorations. So you will see that I am talking <laughs> in this setup video. I was going back and forth with her. There was a lot of banter between us because I kept telling her I need to work. <laughs> but she was saying, I'm paying you. So I need to make sure you know that you're doing everything that I want you to do. It was playful, it was playful. But I just wanna let you guys know that you will see me talking and you may see me rolling my eyes <laughs> a couple of times at her. All right, so let's get started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
All right, guys, so that was my nephew's fifth birthday party. He requested monster trucks, so he is really into monster trucks right now. So he loved that. He loved the cake. He loved the monster trucks that were on the table. Um, and then, of course, he got a bunch of presents where he got some new monster trucks and some new cars. So he was in heaven. Very, very blessed little boy. If you have a son or a nephew, right, or a boy in your family that's looking for a theme for their birthday party, monster trucks is definitely a fun one. So I would recommend that. I got a lot of those ideas for the table from Pinterest. I love Pinterest. You guys know I love Pinterest. So if you're looking for ways to decorate like your dessert table um, or your food table, then you can definitely go on Pinterest and get some ideas, all right? So let me give you guys some feedback based on this event, okay? Let me give you some tips. So number one, when you get some decorations, so I ordered those monster trucks off of Etsy, the ones that I put on the table, and they were hard to put together. Like they did not stay together at all. So what I think I'm gonna do now is when I order something off of Etsy, when I first get the package, I'm gonna put it together just to make sure that it works. Because if it doesn't work out, right, I'm gonna need to send it back and then order something else. So just make sure that you're putting things together and not waiting until the day of the event to do that. And here's another tip for you guys. So when you're making your entryway signs and you're having them printed out at Walgreens or Walmart, make sure that you're checking them. So with this sign, that sign from my nephew that said, welcome to Caden's fifth Monster Jam, you know, the one with the truck, I did not check that sign. I just went to Walgreens and picked it up, left it in the bag, and put it in the pile of decorations for my nephew's party. I didn't even check it. And then when I went to go glue it to the foam board yesterday at my nephew's party, I realized that they didn't cut it correctly. There was one side of the poster that wasn't even cut. So they didn't cut it in the right size. I normally ordered a 20 by 30 and that one was cut. It looked like in a 24 by 36, like the sizing was just completely off on the sign. And thank goodness for my sister, she took the time to cut the edges and make it look better, okay? It didn't look as good as my other signs, but she did take the time to make it look much better. So when you are ordering these signs and you're getting them printed out at Walmart or Walgreens, as soon as you pick up the sign, take it out of the bag, take it out of the packaging and inspect it and make sure that they cut it the way that they're supposed to, okay? So make sure you are inspecting those signs when you get them printed out at a store. All right, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I really loved the way those balloons came out. So I will definitely put the links for the colors that I use in the description of this video because I love the way that they all blended together, all right? If you guys have any questions, please let me know and I'll see you in my next video.